it's me Christy here and I am with a unboxing from a company that I have been wanting to try for a long time I have watched a lot of videos and seen a lot of products for this company and I have really liked what I have seen so I wanted to try it for myself we will get into this and I am filming at a whole different angle I kind of lost my tripod for the moment, so y'all bear with me. I'll be moving the camera around, trying to help y'all get the best, the best view that y'all can get. As y'all see, this is Star Ore, which is ran by a woman named Lucy. And I really have loved what I have seen from this company. So, I got two paintings, and I'm going to start with the first one. And I hope everybody's doing okay. And I personally just got back from a trip to Gatlinburg. Had a wonderful time. So, I hope everybody else is doing well and getting by with COVID. Okay. In a Star or kit, you get a little pamphlet, which says Star or. And then on the back, it tells you the name of the painting and the symbols and the D, the diamonds that you need and the diamonds that you have, which I really like that. It tells you how many that you actually need and how many that you actually will have. That is really cool. If I can get this camera to focus, it don't do, don't like to focus too good. But that is really nice. I like that. And then, of course, it's got instructions on how to diamond paint for anybody that might be new at it. So that is really, really awesome. And then it comes with some parchment paper, which is really cool. Anybody that likes to use parchment paper in their paintings. And these are special grill. These are rhinestones. Then you get a kit which comes in a really nice baggie. I like this and I'm going to look at this because I've never have gotten a star or kit and I just want to see what you get. Okay, you get a pair of really nice tweezers which are branded that do say star or on them. You get a boat and oh, blue wax. Kind of reminds me of Diamond Art Club only it's blue. I got a, I believe it is a, maybe a non-placer and a four-placer, or it might be a six-placer, I'm not sure. And you get a pen with a grippy, and her pens are not the metal, they're kind of the plastic tips, I like that, I've never seen none like that. And you get some baggies, which looks like you get all the baggies that you would need to be able to kit up. And these baggies really look neat. They've got the lines where you can write like the DMC, the number, and all that on them. I really like that a lot. That is very nice. So it definitely comes with a... A nice tool kit. I will put that over there and I will deal with that in a minute. And let's look at the painting that I got. It is called Briar Rose. Is that not beautiful, y'all? I think that's just so pretty. And I'm going to check the stickiness. Oh yeah, it's very, very sticky. And see if I can get this to... Show y'all the little thumbnail right here. Well, the, not the thumbnail, but the key on here. If I can get it to focus on here. It does have the ledger up in here. And then, of course, it has the thumbnail right down here at the bottom. And it, again, it's called Briar Rose. And it is a... The actual drill area is 35 by 47. And it is round. Let me show y'all. I just think that is so pretty. The little rose and like the little glass. I love it. And the canvas is really soft. It kind of feels like Diamond Art Club. And avoid 
I mean, I'm sorry about the crinkle. If you want to mute your phone until I get done, I completely understand. Oh, this also has AB diamonds with it. That is really cool. I really like that. Okay. okay. This is the AB diamond. That is just absolutely beautiful. Kind of like a white, like a pearl. If I can get these to focus. Is that not just so pretty, y'all? Okay. Now, we will look at the diamonds. These are kind of like a purple pink rhinestone. And these are another purplish rhinestone. Which is, these are not wanting to focus. Let's see. And these are a really light pink looking, kind of like a purple shrimp. These are black. Then these are red. And then we got a, like a hot pink right there. These are a blue, really pretty blue. Then we got some more like pinkish purple rhinestones. I can get these to focus. They're really, really shiny. Then we got another bag. It looks like black. And then like a hot pink. Then like a purplish pink kind of thing. Let's see if I can get that to focus in. It's a really pretty color. And then like a blue rhinestone. And then a pink. This has a lot of pink and purple in it. A lot of shades that actually look the same. Here is a blue. And then we have a pink. And another pink. And that looked like it had a runaway blue in it. Yeah, it has a hitchhiker. So I wanted to be pink. And it look, it was actually from this bag, which is blue. Then we have pink. Then we have more pink. And a lighter blue, very beautiful blue. Then a red. Like a green, like a turquoise. Bluish green, very pretty. And then we have another red. Kind of looks orange, but it is red. These are very beautiful rhinestones in here. And I'm going to look at the canvas one more time. I just think this is so pretty. It is Briar Rose. Is it not just so pretty, y'all? And the drill field. Let y'all see if I can get this to focus in. Let y'all see. Very clear. The symbols are really, really clear. Not focusing really good. Y'all are going to have to trust me. They are very clear. And the symbols are all like either numbers or letters. And I don't see any that are alike, which makes it really good. I don't think I'll even have to use a light pad on this. It does not have the training wheels, which I, I like as well. But again, this is called Briar Rose. And I will make sure I list it in the comments below. And if y'all will give me a minute, I'll be right back with the second painting. Alright, I am back with the second painting. And one thing I did notice in the tool kit was it also had a straightener tool, which is really awesome. I really like that. So, so far I'm really, really liking this company. Like I said, I've seen a lot of... Um, a lot of people open do unboxings and I just had to try it. Okay, again, we had the little pamphlet with the key on the back and the name of the painting, which is Above the Moon. Now, 
in it as well. You know, has the parchment paper and the tool kit. I'm not going to go back over it because the same tool kit. Another thing I like, even though it is round, it does have the tweezers as well. And this is a rhinestone as well. Now, we're going to look at this beautiful painting. Is that not just beautiful? Has a lady sitting on the moon and she's got like reaching out for a star. And as y'all can see, stars in the background. It's got a lot of blue and purple in it. I just thought that was really beautiful painting. I really love it. And I'm going to check the stickiness on it. Very, very sticky. And it is very clear as well. About the same key numbers and letters. There are no like symbols or symbols that are going to be hard to tear, tell apart. So I uh, definitely really like this. And it does have where it has the ledger down here. And I just noticed that it has like a checklist. And it does have the DMC as well. So and it shows you how many like you got of each diamond. And that is really, really, really good. I like that. Okay, if y'all can mute it if you don't want to hear the crinkle again until you see me with the crinkling. Okay. Oh my gosh, these are beautiful. Now this has, uh, has a B and rhinestone and regular diamonds as well so this is going to be beautiful i cannot wait i've never done one like this so i really really think this is going to be very very beautiful when it's done these are like two different blue rhinestones very pretty okay then we have we get this way so i can see it better a blue purple another like dark blue and like a light bluish gray and this is a ab a white ab i don't know if y'all can catch the extra sparkle that it has but it is absolutely beautiful i love it then this is a blue and then a purple AB. Oh boy, I don't think I've ever had a purple AB. I absolutely love that. Then this is like a dark navy blue. A light blue, which has a hitchhiker in it, but that's okay. Purple. I love purple. Purple is my favorite color. Then we have a kind of royal blue. And then like a royal deep purple. Then like a orange tannish orange then another like real dark blue then we have kind of like a, I guess it's going to be skin color and then this is going to be purple and then like a light blue more purple a little bit of pink real pretty pink more like navy blue and purple so these are going to be really beautiful. I'm really excited to do these. I've never done a painting where you have the rhinestones and the diamonds and then the ABs all in one. So I'm really excited. And I will be sure that I do a post review to let y'all see what they look like when they are done. And I'm going to show you the painting again. And it is above the moon, I, th I believe is what I called it what it's called and it is from star or so y'all definitely need to get on here and check this company out they have a lot of beautiful paintings they have some that's completely rhinestone and then they have some regular and a special drill i mean just everything you can think of and this one is a 42 by 42 the actual drill area and it is full drill of course but it is just really beautiful I'm very excited to try these paintings, so I will link these both below, and I hope y'all go on there and check them out. And again, thank you for stopping in. Goodbye.